The warmest temperatures of the year are moving in this week, and that has flower farms across the Golden Horseshoe gearing up for the season. For Task Tulip Pick Farm in Fenwick, their two million bulbs are ahead of schedule. We noticed that on the West Coast, uh, a lot of tulip pick farms are delayed about actually almost five weeks, but we're everybody on the East Coast seems to be about um, five days earlier than last year. They say that's thanks in part to recent sunshine and with lots more of it in the forecast this week and temperatures soaring into the low 20s by Wednesday, they'll begin to get taller and some may start to show their colors. Once the sun comes out and they start to bloom, we prefer the cooler weather um, and more overcast so that the, bl the blooms will last longer. Janet Tunchel, owner of Country Cut Flowers near Newmarket, echoes that sentiment, but adds the temperature swings can't be too drastic. I mean, I, one of the concerns is if it turns really cold after, that'll be a real shock for the plants. So hopefully we continue with warm weather, maybe slightly cooler than what we're expecting this week. Long-range temperature models show a gradual cooling back to seasonal starting next weekend, and the tulips and daffodils should be ready by late April or into May. And of course, it's not just flower picking that draws the crowd. The tulips, I'd say the tulip picking is really just one portion of what people want. Most people want that, that great photo with the tulips as a backdrop. And they definitely get it. But there are some ground rules. Stay in the pathways, don't step over the flowers. It's very easy to damage them. Task is set to open April 29th and Country Cut Flowers the first weekend of May. And you are asked to purchase a ticket online in advance of your arrival. Happy picking, Michelle Mackey, City News.